So, the soak setting on your washing machine. What is it and how do you use it? Well, the soak setting on your washing machine is essentially a setting that you can put on that will fill the tub of your washer up with water. The intention of this is that you can pre-soak your garments in this water. You can also add some laundry products to this to increase the potency of this pre-soak. How the pre-soak works is by allowing the water and products time to penetrate deeper into the fibers of your uh, garments so that it can essentially clean them better. You will often find that this setting is used, for example, if you want to pre-treat some stains or perhaps you have garments that smells really bad. Also, it is effective for just general soiling, but um, I will say though that this is a cycle that is best used on top loaders. I have a front loader, so sadly I don't even have this setting. But what you can do instead if you don't have this setting on your washer is that you can either use pre-wash. It is kind of the same. Pre-wash is a little bit more of an active setting where the soak will generally just stay still there in the water. What I generally do is that I pop it into the basin. If you've seen the video I did before, uh, this is a great option. It for us with front loaders. So as far as this cycle goes, what you will generally do is put it on first, fill the tub up with water, add your additives either in the tray or into the, the tub itself. Uh, from here, you generally let it sit there for a while. How long you let it sit depends a little bit on which garment that you are planning to pre-soak. Now, if you use a delicate garment, um, the same rules apply for running cycles as it does with soaking. So that means that you have to use uh, low temperature water. Also generally you should keep the soak uh, phase of the wash pretty at a pretty minimum. I would say maximum 20 minutes. You don't want to over soak these garments. Uh, for your more like little bit sturdy garments or perhaps ones that are a little bit more soaked. Uh, just keep in mind that you, even if your delicates are more soiled cannot increase the, the length or temperature. But for like t-shirts, cotton t-shirts like this, you can increase the duration of the soak cycle a little bit. You can let it go for up to an hour probably without any issue. You can also increase the temperature just at that. It's going to be more effective, especially at removing uh, stains, the more you increase the temperature. For really soiled garments, what I would do personally is that I would pre-treat them and you can leave them in the tub for multiple hours. If you've seen videos in the past, for example, where I have uh, fixed up clothes that are, for example, white t-shirts that's got like a yellow tint. I would leave them for hours and hours to let oxygen bleach work on them. What you could do is also pre-treat them before you pop them into the washer. For example, if you have an enzyme-based uh, stain remover, just pop that onto the garments into the washer. I would also say that you can use detergent pretty effectively to uh, pre-soak your garments. Whether you want to pre-treat the stains uh, before you toss them into the drum or if you want to just load the detergent in the tray or directly into the drum is up to you. Some other really cool additives that you can use is, like I said, oxygen-based bleach is fantastic, but also vinegar and baking soda. Now, mind, you don't want to mix these two as they don't go well together, but either of them is uh, a good option. This is going to help reduce smells in particular and uh, I think this is a great option if you just want something uh, a little bit stronger than pure water. But pure water is also fine to be honest. It's going to help deeply penetrate into those uh, fibers of your garments. Just keep in mind you don't want to go too high on the temperature with the water for delicate but for your more sturdy clothes you can increase the temperature, crank it up a little bit, just check the tags of the garments that you are planning to pre-soak first. So to summarize the steps here, what you want to do for First is separate your clothes into different piles so that you don't <laughs> pre-treat your delicates along with your most dirty and heavy duty clothes. After this you want to add detergent either to the tray or directly into the tub. Fill it up with water to your desired level. Like I said soak on these front loaders is just gonna fill it up a little bit. Uh, <laughs> so do as you please if you have that option. After that you want to pop the clothes in there. If you pre-treat them first do that and then throw them into the tub. From here, close up the tub and start the cycle. On some washers, you are allowed to add like a soak face at the front of the cycle and then you can do like a full cycle afterwards. I would say that that is probably the best way to go. I would also advise you to add an extra rinse. Residue can be a problem, especially if you use a lot of products in the soak and then you add detergent to the main cycle. Uh, anyway, I hope this made sense. Let me know if you have any questions. I've made tons of videos on how to uh, 
uh, soak your clothes in the past, other washing machine settings, make sure to check that out if you want to learn more. And uh, yeah, I also have a newsletter now, sign up to that if you want a free cheat sheet on how to save money doing laundry. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you in the next one.